I mean, we'll just have a little bit of a look and understand the process. I mean, we often talk about that do or die attitude that you need here at Bathurst. And let me tell you, it's happening right here, right now in this garage. These guys are into it. So there's the reveal of the car. First thing you've got to do when you have damage like this is you need to get the car in, up on double stands. You can see the double jacks there so you can get underneath it. And you need to strip it all so you can really assess the damage. Now, the boys have jumped in pretty quick and done that. And let's have a bit of a look. The real bad damage, or the big, big ticket item, is in underneath here. So this is all the subframe area under here that holds the transaxle in the rear of the car and because we've got a big knock in this side it's done a lot of damage and if I just put a little you can see the shut there and if I just if you can just see in under here where the guys are working I'll just put my little pen pointer in there right there they've got a jig and you can see there I don't know there's a gap there so they've still got a little bit of work to do and because unless all that is actually millimetre perfect the whole subframe and the transaxle won't go under there now if we come around the other side you can see all that rear suspension's gone because that's been damaged we'll come around here and just have a look at some of the bits on the floor here now pretty well every corner of this car has been damaged so suspension on every corner if you look down at some of the damage this is indicative of the sorts of things we talk about all these arms all bent and damaged now what worries me about a crash like that not just the wall but when a car comes down hard like that it does those little bits of damage that you often don't see and you get to a lap 100 in the race and you'll have dramas and here's a really good example here's an oil cooler here and look at this little crack just in here that's a really easy sort of thing that i talk about that you might not spot that can catch you out but i talked about these guys fair dinkum getting into it if we can just walk backwards through and have a look this is the front chassis rail that was heavily damaged and have a look only a couple of hours later I'll put my hand down here before it's hot they've already welded a patch in here they've done welding over the top here so these guys are seriously on it a first class effort but i've got to say they'll be going well and truly into the night it's a race against time to be in the great race